Personal watercraft are one of the most popular forms of recreation on the water. But just like any other vessel, PwC are subject to all boating laws, and riders must obey the rules of the road. PwC also have additional regulations regarding safety lanyard use, life jackets, and operator age. Before you enjoy your PwC, it's absolutely essential that you take a boating safety course. You'll also need specific gear. Start with a properly fitted Coast Guard approved life jacket. Neoprene shorts or wetsuit are also recommended to protect your lower body from the force of water exiting the jet pump, or in the case of a fall while moving at high speed. Perhaps most important, before you begin any ride, you must know and completely understand how the controls operate on your specific craft. A personal watercraft has a lot in common with a motorcycle or a snowmobile. Handlebars are used to control direction. Power is applied via a lever adjacent to the right hand grip. As the throttle is applied, water is drawn in below the craft by a fully enclosed water jet pump, then expelled through a reduction nozzle to provide forward thrust. A movable steering nozzle directs that thrust to steer the craft left or right. As thrust is vital for directional control, it's essential that riders realize they must have some degree of throttle applied in order for the boat to turn. Should the driver release the throttle or stop the engine, whether by pulling the safety lanyard or pushing the stop button, input at the handlebars will have absolutely no effect. The craft will continue in a straight line until it eventually coasts to a stop. As releasing the throttle and turning the handlebars is a mistake many novice riders make when presented with an obstacle, nearly all modern personal watercraft now feature off-throttle collision avoidance systems to offer additional maneuverability in these scenarios. These systems apply a small degree of thrust to compensate for a rider releasing the throttle in order to initiate the turn the rider intended. Advanced electronic braking, or deceleration systems, are also available on many modern PwC. These systems redirect thrust to allow craft to hold a neutral position, move in reverse, or at higher speeds rapidly slow and stop to avoid an obstacle or collision. Don't wait until you need one of these systems to learn how they respond. Practice in a safe setting, noting the handling characteristics when you release the throttle, the distance required to come to a stop at speed, and how features like off-throttle steering and electronic brake and deceleration systems provide added control. According to the U.S. Coast Guard, the most common cause of any boating mishap is operator inattention. While various features make a personal watercraft safer to operate, it's still up to you, the driver, to practice responsible boating and avoid unsafe situations. Statistically, collisions pose the greatest threat. When underway, always maintain a safe operating distance between yourself and other boaters. This is particularly important when riding as a group. Before you turn, look over your shoulder to make sure there's not another craft parallel to or behind your craft. When pulling a skier or inflatable, be sure to account for the added distance the rider may swing behind the craft while turning. And always steer well clear of obstacles, including other boats on the water. Remember, personal watercraft are extremely maneuverable and other boaters may not expect the craft to respond in such rapid fashion. Never operate a personal watercraft without the safety lanyard attached. It will stop the engine should you fall off the craft. And though it may seem obvious, never operate a personal watercraft under the influence of alcohol or drugs. Remember these simple tips. To turn your personal watercraft, you must have forward thrust by applying the throttle. Keep a constant lookout for other boaters, personal watercraft, and fixed objects like docks. And when riding with others, avoid riding too close. Riding a personal watercraft is one of the most fun, unique ways to go boating. Ride safely and that fun will last all season long.